Welcome to Chet TV. It is day three coverage of the actual carving competition. I'm Trevor McManus. There are three major differences going into day three. Number one, the sun is gone and it's nothing but rain and clouds all day today. We'll see how that affects the carvers. Number two is the fact that the chainsaws for the most part are put away and it's all about the dremels and the sanding during the detailing process. And number three, the major difference is you. You get to come out here and choose what your favorite sculpture is. So the major question going into this one today is, who's gonna break first, the wood or the carvers? We're really fortunate to be here and be part of the chainsaw carving in Chetwin. It's a, a annual event we look forward to and to be part of it is an important thing for our community. And I have to do some, the base is not ready. I have to lift the whole thing up again and turn around and hope it still holds it up and make a fence out of it. And yeah, we're going to raise the tail into this up a little bit, like um, three inches maybe, and then we're going to take that wedge out, we're going to cut it, we're going to spin it, and we're going to attach it to the front so it's still stabilizing the back of the horse, but then we can make it artistic. So it's going to look like part of the sculpture instead of being just a wedge sticking out there. Last year we thought that the that carvers went really, really fast because we had the return of the champions, so we had the top of the world come back. But these guys are just really, I don't know if they've got a competitive edge this year, but they're really kind of egging each other on and they're checking what everybody's doing and they just seem to be really going. They really want to get a real top-notch finished product by uh, the, the tomorrow afternoon. So they're pushing themselves, they're really, or each other, I don't know what it is, but they're giving it. I'm happy with it. I, uh... I expect to get finished on time, I think. I think so. That's good. I'm tired and sore. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's almost over. Steve. I know. Just imagine how good the beer is going to taste tonight. I know it. So we're right on track. We're going to do a little bit more on the hind end. We're going to start sanding and good to go. We're happy. We're happy. Um, it was a good day. I mean, uh, got a little rain. That's fun. Kind of reminds me of home back in Oregon. And uh, but got most of the most of the stuff done. Everything I wanted to, and just putting on all the uh, all the simple details and hoping for the best. <laughs> 